If you want to see how inspiring inventions came to light, you should definitely watch our picks for the best inventor movies. I didn't take your ideas. Mr. Edison? Sure. Number 10. Hysteria, directed by Tanya Wexler. Defined by a sarcastic tone and its amusing subject, Hysteria is the absurdly true story of scientists developing a new technique to treat women's illness, manually stimulating their private parts. Soon, they stumble upon a way more revolutionary idea, leading them to the invention of the world's very first vibrator and the evolution of the perception of pleasure. That's bloody marvelous! <laughs> Well, that's what I call good, steady pressure. Um, to go any higher. Number nine. Flash of Genius, directed by Mark Abraham. Every invention, no matter how normal it may seem for us today, has to be made and ultimately fought for. Upon inventing the windshield wiper for cars, part-time inventor Robert Cairns thinks he has life set. But upon being pushed away from success by the auto industry, he becomes one underdog against the entire business. Look here. What? Look at that, mister. No hands. He's wondering what the heck's going on. How's he doing that? No hands. Hi. How the heck are they doing that? <laughs> Number eight. It has economy, simplicity, low production costs, potential for mass appeal, and all that spells out great profitability. The Hudsucker Proxy is a comedy film directed by Joel and Ethan Cohen. Karma will come back to you for your greed and shadiness, making businessman Sidney J. Musburger's work life one hell of a nightmare. Obsessed with taking over the company he's working for with a shady stock market deal, he is surprised to see that his plan backfires when a presumably stupid co-worker makes a big invention and a reporter is right on his track. What the hell is it? Well, it's, uh, it's, uh... It's, um... Brilliant! Genius! It's just exactly what Hudsucker industry needs at this juncture. Number seven. Pachpan rupee do. Pachpan rupee? Is it made of Padman is an Indian drama film written and directed by R. Balki. The title of this superhero may sound absurd to the cynical ear, but Padman proves people wrong with his mission to revolutionize the Indian manufacturing of sanitary napkins for women. Upon discovering that in rural India, women struggling with menstruation due to poor hygiene and conditions, he must find a way to offer inexpensive sanitary pads for everyone. So, you will use this clothes? Don't worry about the women's clothes. We know. What do you think of the house? What do you think of the house? I'll take them too. The house and the house... Number six. Shit, that looks good. That looks really good. It's clean and simple. No Disneyland, no live new girls. Watch. The Social Network is a 2010 biographical drama film directed by David Fincher and written by Aaron Sorkin. In 2003, Harvard undergrad Mark Zuckerberg begins work on a new concept that eventually turns into the global social network known as Facebook. Extracted from multiple sources, the film captures the emotion of the first intoxicating days of a phenomenon that now modifies the culture of our world. Mark Zuckerberg is the youngest billionaire in history, but for this entrepreneur, success leads to both personal and legal complications. You better lawyer up, asshole, because I'm not coming back for 30%. I'm coming back for everything. Number 5. You used a control group? They were tested rusting, seated, most of them got bored. Page four. Temple Grandin is a biographical drama television film directed by Mick Jackson. Fight the unexpected and establish to win a war of personal and worldwide manners. Following a real-life title icon, Temple Grandin, who suffered her whole life from autism, we get deep insight into her passion for animals as she visits her aunt's cattle ranch and witness her mission to revolutionize the field of animal care, making her a lifelong advocate for humane slaughtering practices. She's able to concentrate, to interact with others This isn't easily. very scientific. There is no empirical evidence. I can evidence. do an experiment. I, c I can see how it works on other people. I, I can measure heart rate. I, I think it'll work on everyone. Number four. Here, we have her mind. Structured gel. Ex Machina is a 2014 science fiction film written and directed by Alex Garland. 
Caleb, a programmer for the world's largest internet company, wins a competition to spend a week at a private mountain retreat belonging to Nathan, the company's CEO. But when Caleb arrives at the remote location, he has to take part in a strange and fascinating experiment in which he has to interact with the world's first real artificial intelligence, housed in the body of a beautiful robot girl. So we need to break the ice. Do you know what I mean by that? Yes. What do I mean? Overcome initial social awkwardness. So let's have a conversation. Number three. Our job was to crack Enigma. But we've done that. Now for the hard part. The Imitation Game, based on a true war story, is a thriller drama that binds the audience in the suspense of its twists and turns. Directed by Morton Tildum, the movie follows the journey of the great British mathematician Alec Turing as he tries to break the unbreakable German Enigma code with the help of a team of dedicated mathematicians. Thick with the war tension in the air, the movie has us holding our breath, anticipating the moment, with stellar performances from Benedict Cumberbatch, Kira Knightley, and Matthew Good. The Germans will know that we have broken Enigma. They'll stop all radio communications by midday, and they'll have changed the design of Enigma by the weekend. Yes. Two years' work. Everything that we've done here, it'll all be for nothing. Number two. Iron Man is a 2008 superhero film directed by John Favreau. Being the beginning of a new era for comic book movies, Iron Man delivers the most charismatic Marvel protagonist yet to film. This is the story of Tony Stark, a weapon industry mogul who decides to use his technology for good after a life-changing event. But he'll soon find out that not everyone likes his new way. <laughs> Yeah, I can fly. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. You want to know what was in the 13-hour ball? I know how it works. Yeah, I know you do. I only wondered what it felt like. What? The ball. When you knew. What was the feeling in that moment? What is he doing? Wow, it really does get all the corners that my sponge mop won't get. All those crannies where my kids spill their juice. I really like it. Can we buy it? Take it easy, Christy. <laughs> Number one. When this baby hits 88 miles per hour, you're going to see some serious shit. Back to the Future is a 1985 science fiction film directed by Robert Zemeckis. This all-time classic family adventure is not only incredibly inventive, but pure joy. An exciting time travel adventure leads teenager Marty McFly on a mission to rescue his own existence in the universe. When accidentally changing the timeline so his parents never get together, he must reunite them before it's too late and his existence ultimately vanishes. Do you agree with our list? please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.